Congratulations, guys! We are nearing the end of the 58th IMO. And we all know how to add things up. If it's the end of one cycle, it's immediately the beginning of a new one. We will leave Rio de Janeiro even more excited about mathematics and its young researchers. An excitement that will fool our progress until we meet again next year at the 59th IMO to be held in Romania. The first country to host the IMO in 1959. Now, at this special moment, let's receive here on stage Mr. Geoff Smith, IMO chairman, for his final words. Mr. Geoff Smith! So, could we put the music down? Thank you very much. Uh, this has been a fantastic competition. Um, I think the questions were exceptionally beautiful. Um, sometimes on math links and art of problem solving, they say the problems are too easy. Well, they didn't say that this time. You have all been congratulated, and everybody has been thanked several times. So there's no need for me to do any more of that, though it was a brilliant IMO. I want to have a quick word with the, uh, the director of the next IMO, because I have a request. You're doing this uh, girls' award again? Sure. Very good. So on the presentation party, could we have a woman, please? Yes. Okay, so Brazil, you've done a fantastic job. You've got the flag. That's great. So could you pass it along slowly and with seriousness to the middle? So, and so Romania takes charge for how many times you've done this? Six times. For the sixth time, Romania takes charge of hosting the IMO. Congratulations. So, uh, I am very proud to be ready to organize with my colleagues the six International Mathematical Olympiad in Romania. I hope that it, be, it will be at least so well organized as in Rio, and the problem should be at least so difficult as in Rio. <laughs> so see you in Cluj, Napoca, Transylvania, Romania next year. Welcome to Transylvania, the land beyond the forest. And welcome to Cluj, the heart of Transylvania, Romania's fastest growing city and the most influential city in Western Romania. So, why might you love Cluj? Maybe it's the academic spirit. Since Cluj is home to Romania's top 10 universities, providing a highly educated workforce in more than 300 different specializations from IT to medicine or agriculture research and development. Or it might be its constantly growing infrastructure with modern highways and a well-connected airport serving more than 1 million passengers per year. You might also appreciate the city's blooming economic environment with more than 25 banks represented here and home of the biggest private Romanian bank, Cluj is a great place for business. We pride ourselves as Europe's Silicon Valley and the home of clusters, 
But IT is not the only high-end industry represented in Cluj. Some of the world's business leaders have offices here and their businesses are constantly expanding. Cluj is a city with a rich heritage, but with a strong cosmopolitan philosophy. With an interesting mix of Romanians, Hungarians, Germans and other nationalities living here, it's no wonder we are ranked Europe's number one friendliest city towards foreigners. Did you know that Cluj has one of the highest living standards in all of Europe? This might come as a surprise, but with two international schools, several cultural events relevant on a continental scale, we pride ourselves in offering a five-star living experience. By the way, did we mention that through its modern infrastructure and passionate audience, Cluj is Romania's sports and music capital? We are indeed proud of our city, but we know we would not be what we are without the influences from everybody interacting with us. So we strongly believe that together we can make Cluj better. So welcome, and we can't wait to share your vision and see how we can grow Cluj together. Welcome to Cluj Napoca in the heart of Transylvania. Welcome to the 59th International Mathematics Olympiad. See you in Cluj Napoca next year.